Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm gonna talk about a country which is located in South America and its capital city is Bogota and has this flag, the country is Colombia. But today I'm gonna talk about Bogota, the capital city, but more specifically I'll talk about the Museum of Gold, also known in Spanish as El Museo del Oro. But before we start, press the like button, subscribe and share the video. The Museum of Gold is a museum located in Bogota, Colombia. It is one of the most visited touristic highlights in the country. The museum receives around 500,000 tourists per year and the museum displays a selection of pre-Columbian gold and other metal alloys such as Tumbaga. Tumbaga is the name for a non-specific alloy of gold and copper given by Spanish conquistadors to metals composed of these elements. And also the museum contains the largest collection of gold artifacts in the world in its exhibition rooms on the second and third floors, together with pottery, stone, shell, wood and textile objects. A quick description about the museum, the museum has a collection of 55,000 pieces, 6,000 of which are on display in their expanded building. There are bilingual descriptions of almost all exhibits. On the first floor houses the museum's main entrance, a shop and a restaurant. Exhibitions begin on the second floor. The main room is called People and Gold in Pre-Hispanic Colombia. And glass veterans display goldsmiths work from the different cultures which inhabited Colombia before the Spanish colonists arrived. The permanent exhibition is divided into different halls for every culture. The cultures are Kalima culture, Kumbaya civilization, the Musica, the Zenu, the Tolima, and Uraba. The exposition continues on the third floor the first shows the process of shamanic ceremony with its different gold pieces. The second is divided into three parts, the offering room, the offering boat, and the lake. At the end of the exposition, there is a profanditation room with artistic videos about the most important gold pieces of the museum. Now about the history of the museum, in 1934, the Bank of the Republic began helping to protect the archaeological patrimony of Colombia. The object known as Poporo Quimbaya was the first one in a collection. It has been on exhibition for 70 years. The museum houses the famous Musica Golden Raft found in Pasaca in 1969 that represents the ceremony of the new Zipa ruler of Bacata. In this representation, he is seen standing at the center of a raft surrounded by the principal chieftains, all of them adorned with gold and feather. After a decade of work, the museum was expanded and renovated in October 2008. The renovation, the museum organized a permanent exhibition in five rooms with archaeological objects and an interactive room. It also added an auditorium, some temporary exhibition rooms, a cafe, a restaurant, and a souvenir store. I hope you guys enjoyed the journey to the Museum of gold and were able to understand few facts about the museum. I'll be showing five questions on the screen and comment the correct answers in the comment section below. And before I end the video, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. The questions are around how many tourists are there per year? What is Tumbaga? How many pieces are on display? Name three cultures found in the museum. Which object was the first in a collection?